the Burlington Community Scholarship Foundation recently held their 22nd annual Telethon with its traditional host, Jack Farron. Let's get our first look at the tote board. We can't do it without our local businesses, most of which are the small businesses here in the town of Burlington. And Corporate America, of course, pitches in for the Adopt-A-Class program. Uh, and then we, then we write grants during the course of the year, myself and Joe Adabato, the head of guidance. So tonight we raised some dollars for scholars. We had um, three local restaurants chip in and give us uh, dinners for six, Capitol Grill, Burton's Grill, and Taz uh, valued at $600. They were great auction items. Uh, new co-host this year comes from the board of directors, Joe Warino, did a fabulous job. My cousin Kathy O'Neill was running the people in and helping my son. And, Mike Telopoulos and his family, I mean, they supported us with all of the food. So we were able to uh, donate uh, food for the uh, BCAT staff, the wonderful BCAT staff, as well as for the guests that were coming in and so kind to help out with everything we've got going on and raising, raising funds. We were actually able to get uh, the entertainment for the night. Uh, Sam Wolf, who finished uh, Top 5 American Idol, has um, played at Newtown in Bill Ricca, and he's playing again. He'll be there uh, April 27th. It's Friday night, 8 o'clock. Uh, so we're looking forward to that. Burton's brought some food too, and for those of you at home that are, were watching this event, we had boys and girls making phone calls, and we had the waters donated by Reading Cooperative Bank, and we had all the pizzas that came from flatbread. So everybody was hydrated, everybody was eating, we had a good time, and I want to thank the Telopolis family one more time for bringing in Sam Wolf, uh, who was one of the finalists from American Idol. It was a nice night for Burlington, raising dollars for scholars, and go BCAT. From right here in the BCAT studio, I'm B News reporter Tad Stefanak.